Hello, this is Cast Blue, and welcome back to more Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. Last time we did stuff, like getting enemy skills. This time, we're doing more stuff, but not like getting enemy skills. Okay, you assholes seem familiar. Um, why do you always poison Tifa? Just see, see what I mean? Well, actually, no. To be fair, you have occasionally been known to poison your allies as well. Um, but as far as my guys, it's pretty much always Tifa. Which is a little bit weird. But, you know, whatever. Okay, I don't really think Hyper Fury... Yeah, that one. I don't think Fury is a really a great combination with cover, but, you know, I, I can't be bothered to cure it. And it does get me limit breaks more quickly. Cool. Actually, I've been getting a lot of um, material level ups lately. The enemies in this area have like crazy high AP. Hmm, anything here? Oh, there is, actually. There is actually a thing there, but I but I cannot seem to reach it. Uh, right. We're gonna do that. And okay. I was like, wait. And again, you poison Tifa every single time. Well, you're dead now. So. Oh yeah, yeah. That's pretty dead. Oh hey, now Cloud has his limit break. Actually, I could just save that. Haha, -ha, it doesn't matter if I miss a death blow because I have ad cut! Haha! -ha! Okay, so actually just re This mechanic, I mean obviously it's not useful right now, is actually super useful. I mean ad cut in general is super useful, but this is something that occurred to me between episodes. Um when you're in the end game. There are certain we- oh hey, there's a save point. There are certain weapons that are better with a full limit break. Consequently, having, um, add cut with a skill like, um, like, I just bloody said it, with a skill like Deathblow is the best way to use those weapons, which makes it an amazing combination for the late in the- well, yeah, for late in the game. I mean, it's already a good combination at any point of the game, I think, but it is especially good late on. Hmm. I think that- I want to say that Tifa's and Vincent's ultimate weapon both- ultimate weapons, rather, both benefit from having full limit break. At least one of them does, for sure. Uh, anyway, we are not, we are not nearly there yet. And actually, I still want to combine it with Mug. I think that would be awesome. You know, if I ever get Mug in a million years. Because the steel skill just takes for, or the steel material just takes forever to level up. I wonder if they can poison themselves themselves as well. Hmm. Cause I I mean if they can attack themselves, it stands to reason they would be able to, but I don't know. I really have to wonder. I really do wonder. I mean honestly, I'm surprised they aren't immune to poison. The fire armlet. Well Oh no! It's an icicle! Right, so I'm gonna just, um. Uh, I don't suppose I have fire all on anyone, do I? Hmm. Well, we're still gonna do this. I'm not even sure if this will work, to be honest. But, uh, no, that's. That seemed pretty effective. I mean, the icicle's still there, so. Maybe not perfect, but. Damn, bats are in the way. I took 
Ephraim off of Barret as well, so I can't use... I can't use that as a hit-everyone move either. Hmm. Right, uh, let's do that. And let's use Grenade Bomb. Which does not seem to hit the Icicle. Hmm. Although, this might get me my next Limit Break with Barret? I'm not sure. Okay, that is the sort of bullshit I'm talking about with these bats. I mean, come on! The damn thing dodged a limit break! Oh hey, the ice will crack, so now the battle is over. And the ice fell! Wait for it, and the ice fell! No. Okay, so we're gonna do this three more times, it's gonna be the same battle, so I'll meet you when we're done. Oh hey, we got Tifa's next limit break. Gonna need to show that off next time I get it. Hmm. Well in any case, back to cutting. Right now. And we're back. Swoosh. Whoosh. W whatever. Um Mega Elixir. Cool. So, uh, yes? I believe so. So what, he like just always runs to the middle? Hmm. So they're kind of just out of the way. But this is way over here. And all of those ice skills raised the water level, I guess? I mean, they certainly filled the hole. That much is clear. I wonder if I have a tent. Man, have I... Have I literally ever used a tent in this game? I'm not sure if I have. But now strikes me as a good time to use one. Okay, I only have five, so I'm almost positive that I never have. Mm, you know what? I don't need to. I know it's coming up, and it is not dangerous enough. Although, you know what? I have not fought a single Stilva since I came up here. So, now I'm starting to think maybe I made the right call staying back there to fight it beforehand. In any case, I've already done it, so I guess anything to justify my decision. An enhanced sword. Not enhanced, mind you, but an enhance. I guess because it enhances its targets, or... yeah. Uh... Lots of slots, but it is significantly weaker than the organics. So, I'm gonna stick with this one. Oh, it's another Malboro! Uh, okay, so I am going to use Beta on you, because you are actually legitimately pretty dangerous! I mean, no, not really. That's actually str strictly not true, since Cloud can just murder you. Uh, however, I did want to avoid my other characters taking too much damage during this fight. Hence, hence Beta. Okay, well, on the bright side, next battle, I am totally... Oh, you used Bio 2 as well, I did not know that. Hmm. Right, as I was saying, on the bright side, as long as Tifa doesn't die, she will be using her limit break on the next bat. Damn it! Why do you keep doing this to Tifa? How she got her next limit break before Barrett, I'll never know. Admittedly, she does have really low life. But even so, this is getting a little bit ridiculous. Um, just a little bit. No, not you. In fairness, she did a fury in that, so that didn't help, but... Even so. Well, 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 anyway. I mean, actually, compare... Actually, having said that, comparing with Barret is really not fair. Barret has almost... Well, no, he doesn't have almost twice the HP. Per HP, but he does have more than 50%. Excuse me, 
More than 50% more. In fact, he has like 70% more HP. Wait, no. 60% more HP than Tifa. And he's on the back row as well. So it's not really a good comparison. Oh, I'm outside again. Great. Um, now, I'm pretty sure I want to go to the left, except I think there's a box up here? I mean, we'll see, I suppose. Uh, oh, maybe I was mistaken. Maybe it doesn't even matter. No, keep going. That was a little bit annoying. Yeah, these just connect. I mean, I took a detour, but... But they go to the same place, so it doesn't actually matter. Hmm. I don't know why they would really do that here, actually. Because, like, the thing is... In this air, it's not like they're preying on your lack of knowledge for knowing how to warm up. Because, let me tell you... I'm speaking from experience here. <laughs> it is impossible to climb all the way up Gaia Cliff without warming yourself up at least once. Because the first time I played through here, I did not properly understand the warm-up mechanic. So I tried, and it is not doable. Okay, you're new. Uh, Blue Dragon. I wonder if you have any good steals. Nope. Nothing at all. Well, I may as well just kill you then. Okay. I will admit, you do hit pretty hard with that tail of yours. But, well, now you're poisoned, so joke's on you. Okay. You are like the fight I was expecting the Stilva to, to be. Actually pretty strong. Um, right, let's just, uh, let's do that. And... I mean, if I get a chance, I'll totally use Barret's Limit Break, but no, it's dead. Clouds, though, no. We are, like, ri Oh, hey, Dragon Armlet. That is, like, yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, okay, you have the Fire Ring, and you have Ice Immunity. So, we're gonna give that to Tifa, I think. Yeah, this is a good choice. It does lower my defense percentage slightly, which I'm pretty sure is evasion, but it erases my actual damage reduction way more, so... Plus also, you know, the effect is actually really good. And I can throw Ifrit back on you. Or Odin, I suppose, but... Man, your HP is low enough. That's why Tifa's HP is so low, actually. She has she has ten summons on her. Maybe not literally ten, but quite a few all the same. Mm. Now, is there... No. Oh, no! This does... Okay, that's a free heal. Awesome. And useful. I recognize this hallway. That's a... what the... Oh, that's a guy in a cloak. But that's not all! Eh, you done? It's also... A two-headed dragon! Yeah, this thing is kind of freaky looking. Um, one does ice attacks, the other does fire attacks. Uh, naturally, one, naturally, they are immune to the thing that they do, and, actually, I think they absorb it, and they are weak against the other one. I don't remember which is which, though. <laughs> so, I'm mostly gonna just beat them up with things that are neither ice nor fire aligned. 
Uh, for example, this is a good time to break out Alexander, actually. Um, I want to say Trine is also really good in this fight, but... Oh! I almost forgot. I almost forgot. This is like the first boss in the bloody game where I can actually steal something from one of the heads. I don't remember which one. I hope I didn't just kill them, actually. Because I know this is actually a pretty weak boss. Oh, wait, no. It, it has a fair amount of HP. Yeah, check it out. Thievery! Uh, that's the right head? I mean, I honestly don't know if that's the one... one I don't even know if they both have stuff to steal. But I know one of the heads has something that's pretty good. Oh, I forgot about the earth... Uh, I totally forgot about the earth damage. But no. No, 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 no. It is Final Fantasy IX preview time, which means it is spamming stealing while not actually attacking the boss time. Oh, that's gonna be fun when we do it. I honestly don't actually... Talking years ahead of time right now, I honestly am not sure how I'm gonna handle that when I get to Final Fantasy IX. Because, naturally, I'm gonna need to steal everything from pretty much every boss. Uh, but it will that legitimately takes a really long time with some bosses. Particularly in the earlier game, actually. Because later on you get some skills that help you uh, speed up the stealing process. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna like cut things or what for that. It's, it's gonna definitely be an interesting thing to figure out. But not not for quite a while. We have at least two more Final Fantasy games before we get to nine, I'd say. So, man, you really hate Tifa. Good thing I gave her the damn, uh, oh, right, counterattack. Good thing I gave her the freaking Dragon armlet. Man, I wasn't even thinking of that, but she definitely needs the survivability from it more than Barret. Uh, I mean, if Barrett just kills the head, that's not the end of the world, but I would really like to steal this. Stealing is so slow in this game! <laughs> and the only thing I can do to speed it up is leveling up, so... That's not really a good solution. Uh, can you please just get it, Cloud? I mean, come on. Come on, Cloud, come on! Man, I can't even check which... Check my notes for what it was. That's really annoying. Because... Oh! That, that's what it was. That's actually a really good item. Okay. That's totally worth it. Uh... There we go. Now, I wonder if the other head has anything. I don't think it does, but I don't specifically recall. Meteor Drive, aka Suplex! Did, did I, like, kill a head, or? Nope. I did not kill a head. Uh, although, a head killed T. Oh no, I did kill a head. I see. I forgot that it did the... I forgot that it did that. Right, so let's revive Tifa. Uh, let's use Cure 2. I guess we could use Regen in this fight. That would have probably sped things up. And let's use Cl Climb Hazard on the other head. So yeah, Tifa can now do a suplex. She has, I think it's fair to say, that she has reached her ultimate potential. Never will she be 
as great as she is in this moment. It's all downhill from here, Tifa. <laughs> That's actually kind of true. Um, Tifa's limit break is legitimately super good at this part of the part of the game. And she, oh no, she didn't die that time. Awesome. But as I get the the last few limit breaks with more characters, they're gonna start being better than hers. Because the thing is, the, the reason her limit break is good right now is because it hits several times with high damage attacks. But most characters hit more than once with their last two with their last few limit breaks. At least their final with their final limit break. It's it's more it's more iffy for the level three ones. Like, I know Cloud has a level three limit break hits a lot, but I'm not sure Barrett does, for instance. Oh hey, no more heat timer. I guess that must mean we're at the top. Maybe I should have run back to save. Oh wow, actually, look at the time. Um climbing back down. We need to stop off here. Join me next time when we peek Guy's Cliff and see what's beyond. Until then, this has been Chaos Blue, and have a great day. Bye!